In a recent video, we looked at the UK's newly selected alternative individual weapon system, the L403A1. The Knight's Armament KS1 was selected as the new rifle for the Ranger Regiments of the Army Special Operations Brigade and elements of the Royal Marines Commandos. One question which frequently appeared in the comments was, can it fit a bayonet? This is a good question because the British Army is known to be a proponent of bayonet use, with a long history of using it to great effect from the 1600s right through to recent conflicts in Iraq and Afghanistan. The short answer to the question is yes, but the longer answer is a little bit more complex. Just a week after the selection of the new rifle was announced, Knight's Armament displayed one of the rifles with a bayonet fixed at the DSEI 2023 Exposition in London. This naturally caught some attention. However, when the selection of the L403A1 was initially announced, a breakdown of the alternative individual weapon systems, accessories and ancillaries was released. This included a Vortex 1-10 LVPO, an Aimpoint Acro, and the QDC MCQ PRT, standing for Quick Detach Coupling, Mini Close Quarters, Pressure Reduction Technology, the suppressor, along with a sling, a vertical front grip, and a surefire weapon light, but noticeably the package didn't include a bayonet. The ability to fix a bayonet was not part of the weapon's original requirements, and it was not stipulated by the rangers or the commandos. Instead, Knight's Armament developed the capability themselves, perhaps recognising the UK's fondness for bayonets, and the British Army's long history of their use as both a training aid and as a weapon of war. We reached out to Egg Brothers and Knight's Armament about the bayonet, and they confirmed that the bayonet was designed in anticipation of a potential need, though not required as part of the contract. The bayonet seen fixed to the rifle at DSEI was apparently the first iteration of the design which, according to Knight's, used the same mounting mechanism as the suppressors, but a new, revised design uses an attachment mechanism which is more similar to the SA-80 bayonet attachment retention design. Essentially, rather than using the suppressor's quick-detach coupling system, the newer iteration of the bayonet uses a pivoting catch. The quick-detach method used by the suppressors involves the suppressor being rolled one way until the index pin seats in a notch, before tightening it by twisting it in the other direction. The new iteration of the bayonet fits over the rifle's three-prong QDC muzzle device, and uses the same style of catch system as the SA-80 L85. Knights explained that the redesign was a refinement of an initial concept after some basic testing and feasibility evaluation. The bayonet hasn't undergone any serious testing, as they're still in the development phase. A chromed version of the latest iteration of the bayonet was also actually displayed at DSEI in September. It has a removable pommel piece that can act as a small storage space, and makes the bayonet more comfortable to use as a knife. The bayonet's blade is offset to the left with a corresponding hole which lines up with the rifle's muzzle. What form the final bayonet will take is unclear, and it's also unclear if a requirement for a bayonet will ever be issued. While bayonets aren't currently planned to be issued with the rifles, the requirement might develop once they enter service. If in the future the UK Ministry of Defence requested a bayonet for the new rifles, it seems that knights could be able to oblige. Thanks to everyone who commented on the previous video about the L403A1. Thank you to Gregory Knowles for some of the photographs of the bayonet from DSEI. And also thank you to Knight's Armament for answering some of my questions. And of course, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe. If you enjoyed the video, please do consider supporting us via Patreon, where you can get early access to all of our videos. Thanks again for watching. Catch you next time.